Hey guys, it's Lam here again, your tech guy, doing another video review on the Galaxy Watch 4 40 millimeter. So we're doing a battery test on this device, and um, we are at 100% right now, as you can see, right there, 100%. And the battery capacity on this is at, I think it is 247 milliamp. There it is. So we're gonna do a real world battery life test. Pretty much the same as I did on my previous Active 2 and Watch 3. You know, just uh, my, uh, my regular um, daily routine. Um, I've got this always screen display turned on. I got um, heart monitoring um, always on continuous mode. The screen display is uh, number three. NFC location and what else is there? Has been turned off and I've got all the notification, all my um, multimedia, my uh, Facebook, YouTube, Messenger. They're all activated guys. So as you can see, we are all ready to go. I'm gonna slap this on my wrist and then I'll just uh, vlog it, give you guys maybe every one hour or two hours interval. We're gonna follow up the battery life on this. So let me just put this on my wrist so we could get started and make sure I got my timer. Wow, I almost forgot my timer here. So I'm gonna start my timer once I remove this on the charger. Here we go. All right, so fully 100%. Okay, let me just slap this on my wrist. And of course, when I go to bed, I'm gonna turn on my sleep mode. As usual. And uh, there you go. So here is my watch face for today's test. We've got the battery right there at 100% and we've got the date on top. And yeah, so we'll uh, check it out within an hour or two. 1.15 in the morning and the time is one hour and 10 minutes. And our battery, we are at 97%. All right, so I'm just gonna show you guys a little bit more of the settings. So you guys know what I have. So I've got the always screen display. Screen brightness is at number three. Wi-Fi turned off. Location, NFC and airplane mode, they're all off. 2.22 in the morning, and we are at two hours and 17 minutes. We're gonna activate sleep mode and um, wake up early in the morning again, maybe around seven or eight, then I'll deactivate sleep mode and we'll continue from there. All right, so the time is 2.22 and it is two hours and 17 minutes. Let me try to activate sleep mode right here. Flick my wrist. Oops. And that's it. Good night, guys. I'll see you tomorrow morning. Good morning, everybody. It is 7.19 in the morning and the time is seven hours and 14 minutes now we're gonna try to reactivate or wake up our watch from the sleep mode let me just put that down the camera first okay here we go turn off sleep mode and our battery we are at, let me take a look here. We're at 81%, 8.37, and we are at eight hours and 32 minutes. And the battery, we are at 76%. 
Okay, so when I woke up this morning, I was um, watching YouTube videos. And of course, once you play, if you're watching YouTube videos, will also show the multimedia on the watch. So it did drain a little bit um, faster than usual, but um, that's what it is, you know. That's my daily routine. I wake up, watch a few videos before I fully get up from bed. And uh, yeah, so again, we are at 8.38 in the morning. So we still have a long way to go. And um, I'm kind of worried that we are already at 76%. 10.42 in the morning and we are at 10 hours and 37 minutes in the battery. We are at 66%. All right, so I'm debating if I should go out for a scooter ride and uh, play my Bluetooth music. But the problem is when I play my Bluetooth, it's gonna eat more on my watch. So I'm gonna try to postpone that and just uh, scoot around without the music. And maybe next time, uh, because it's just gonna eat it out a lot, guys. Usually on my daily basis, I don't uh, do that. But today, since it's my day off, I wanted to do it, but due to the test, I can't, guys, because it's just gonna kill my watch much faster. All right, 12 noon, 12.04, and the time is 11.59 minutes. And we are at 56%. All right, guys, so I just got off from my dental appointment. And uh, the time is at, we're at 2.15 p.m. And we are at 14 hours and 10 minutes. Now we're gonna check the time. I mean, the battery life we have left. We are at 45%. 4.23 p.m. And we are at 16 hours and 18 minutes. Battery, we are at 35%. 6.40 p.m. We are at 18 hours and 35 minutes. And battery is at 20%. 8.35 p.m. We are at 20 hours and 30 minutes. And the battery, we are at 9%. All right, guys, so we are at 22 hours and the time is 10.05 p.m. and the battery is at 5%. All right guys, so we are closing in. We are at 10.45 p.m. and it is 22 hours and 40 minutes and our battery life is 1%, okay? So as you can see, the battery life with the watch 4, I've been abusing it today. Um, oh. There you go. Battery's dead, guys. So like what I said, today I was using a lot of... Um, I was playing Spotify and um, activating the GPS on Google Map. So when you activate that on your phone, your watch um, gets activated as well using uh, more battery than usual. Whereas on my daily basis, on a regular basis, usually I don't listen that much to Spotify or activate my GPS. But today, you know, it's my day off. I was traveling a lot today, going out all over the place. So, you know, I needed the GPS, um, the Google map, and uh, I was listening to Spotify. And the uh, outcome is right there, guys. So it was around 22 hours and I think 40 minutes. I've been abusing the watch for today. And the outcome is this, guys. Not even a day or so. So you really have to um, minimize your Spotify or your Google map to get you through the day. But if you are a heavy user using the GPS, you know, the um, Google map or li love to listen to Spotify, you will get a shorter battery life on your watch for 40 millimeter. So that's pretty much it, guys. I hope this video will help you guys out. Maybe next time I'll do another one that, you know, I don't use the Google map or the spot up oh shoot this uh oh battery's dead the spotify more often 
But anyways, that's pretty much it. Once again, thank you for watching my video. Until then, I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.